Welcome to the first principal report for second term. Already we are two weeks into second term. Hard to believe, time flies when you're having fun and fun is what we do certainly have here at Hazel Glen College. Last Saturday, the 21st of April, we had our open day here at the college. Can I take this opportunity please to thank a number of people. First of all, the students. Uh, we had over 300 students across the college acting as tour guides or showcasing various parts of our college curriculum. The students did an absolutely marvellous job throughout the morning from 9 o'clock until uh, 1 o'clock in the afternoon we had a stream of parents uh, flowing through the college grounds. Uh, certainly the enthusiastic tour guides uh, took them to all parts of the compass around our college. So to those students, thank you very much. To the staff, congratulations, fantastic showcasing of our college. Because quite honestly, an open day is about showcasing, not just about promoting our college to new families coming into the college, but also about showcasing to existing families what actually is happening here at the college if parents have not had an opportunity to come up and have a look around. So certainly from our kindergarten program, to our junior school, to our middle school, and to our year nine and year 10 senior school program, a uh, job well done by all. So to all involved, thank you very much. One of the exciting moments that we have uh, on our opening day was for the first opportunity to, for many people, parents, teachers, and students to look through our new senior school building that's been under construction for the last 18 months. We're expecting handover of this building uh, at the end of next week. So to have a sneak preview was an absolute delight for many people. In addition to the senior school building, we have two basketball courts, outside basketball courts, that will be opened up for the students as well. And also for the staff, we have another car park. Over the next few weeks, we're looking at having our uh, second bike shed, a bike shed for the middle school and senior school students to be completed. Waiting on the concrete to be poured for the foundation for the floor and also the rails to go in. And while I'm talking about the bike shed, can I also please encourage once again students about sustainable transport. Walking to college, riding or scootering. Over the week we've had a number of Anzac services and I'd like just to uh, give a brief outline of those. There could have been no better opportunity to provide a whole college event than we had here on Tuesday morning at nine o'clock where we had near on 3,000 students, parents and teachers attend our Hazel Glen College Anzac service. Uh, can I thank the students for the uh, respectful way that they conducted themselves throughout the service and we also had, I should add, a number of our kinder students uh, attend for the uh, Anzac service. Can I take this opportunity to thank uh, all members of our school community for your involvement in the Lorimer RSL Cenotaph Dawn service that was held on Anzac morning on Wednesday. Again, there couldn't be any prouder moment than for all to be part of that uh, respectful and reflective service that was held at Lorimer in the early hours of Wednesday morning. And again, to see the stream of parents who met at Hazel Glen Drive to walk down as a college uh, to be involved in that service was absolutely uh, an incredible feeling. So as you can see, we've had a lot on in the first two weeks of the term. Thank you very much and I look forward to catching up with as many parents as I can over the next few weeks. Thank you.